Well, for pet owners, it's hard watching your dog age and suffer with arth arthritis or joint problems. But there is a cutting edge procedure using stem cells that could help dogs avoid surgery and drugs. Seven's Richard Lemus shows us a new way to help pets dogged by pain. This is our favorite trick, timber. <laughs> To Jordana Reed, her nine-year-old dog, Shayna, is just as special as any human she knows. Shayna's my best friend. She kept me company through school. She's family. My husband loves her as much as I do, so she's like our child. The Reeds even picked out a two-story home with a big backyard just for their pets. They didn't know Shayna would not be able to enjoy the new home. We brought the animals over to introduce them to their new home. And my husband and I were heartbroken when we realized that she was unable to go up the stairs. Shayna was suffering. She was limping a lot and we found out she had torn the ACLs in both back knees. Vets suggested surgery, but Jordana was concerned it was too risky. So she decided to try a cutting edge procedure, a stem cell transplant. Vets like John Willie are now using stem cells to treat dogs who have arthritis or bad joints. We're actually taking an animal's own stem cells and putting them back into their own body so there's no rejection. Vets remove a small amount of body fat from the dog. From the fat, they take and harvest stem cells and then inject those cells back into the dog. We will inject it into their hip, into their elbow, into their wrist, into their knee, wherever the arthritis is at. These stem cells have the ability to go throughout the whole body and find the areas of inflammation and hone in on those areas. The idea, the stem cells will stimulate growth of healthy cells and healing, so no surgery is needed. Around eight weeks, you'll see a vast improvement. In the past, doctors had to send these stem cells to an outside lab to be processed, a process that takes 48 hours and is very expensive. This new treatment by Stem Logics is done right in the vet's office. It's a one day procedure. The cells are more viable, they're more alive. I would say anywhere from 75 to 90% of the animals respond to this. Come on, let's go. Shayna is one of those success stories. That cam has been kind of miraculous. It's everything that we could have hoped for. She healed really quickly from the surgery. Come on. The dog is now climbing the stairs on her own, and Jordana says she acts like a young pup again. I got my Shayna back. The procedure costs between $1,200 and $2,000, but that's less than what it would cost for a surgery and the medications your dog would need. Vets are hoping to perform the procedure on cats soon. In the Plex, Richard Lemus, 7 News.